VR is a completely different beast to normal games. It speaks to some fundamental parts of the human brain. It's like the difference between watching a great sporting moment on TV and actually being there. Not only do we have 3D visuals, but in our virtual reality system, we also have 3D audio as well. And the amazing thing is, this works for any pair of headphones. Binaural audio or 3D audio is about mimicking how our brains perceive sounds coming in in the world around us. 3D audio is a technology that, that speaks directly to your emotions. Well, one of the things that it brings to the experience is that it allows you to create much more believable soundscape. And more importantly, you can make things feel real for the player, feel believable. It's all very well being able to create a wonderful 3D model of an environment, but if nothing makes any noise, then you're not going to believe it. If there's a, an object that would make noise in the real world, it should be making noise in the virtual world. For example, in a horror game, if, there was a, if you wanted a sound to distract that was in the world, uh, you could use that as a distant distraction and then have a, a, a louder, uh, closer, much closer sound to really infiltrate the, the personal space of the player and really give them the scare you want to. With 3D audio, we can uh, lead the player a lot more than you could do with a simple stereo setup. I mean, a good example in VR worlds is in one of the interrogation scenes. There's a, a moment where a train passes by overhead and triggers a fault in the electrics and the exit light. So we direct the player's attention to the fact that there's an exit over here. And so we're able to do that with just the audio. Tech that hadn't been investigated as well enough in the past has been brought to the fore again. It's great the interest that audio is getting for VR. Having these new tool sets to take the audio to that next step has been absolutely amazing as a sound designer because now finally I'm able to create those spaces, those, those worlds that I've always wanted to do. For the players.